Someday we'll get paid for this. It's now time for Piggy of the Week. Very soon, Pennsylvania will inaugurate Tom Corbett as our new governor. During the campaign trail, he claimed something very extraordinary. Tom Corbett claimed that Pennsylvania, particularly the Marcellus Shale region, or Marcellus, or Marcellus, it's a shale region, has so much natural gas that it's considered, and I quote here, that's why I'm doing this, the Saudi Arabia of natural gas. That's right, he considers Pennsylvania the Saudi Arabia of natural gas. That's great. That should mean that Pennsylvania, like Saudi Arabia, will give free health care, cheap heat, and free college education to all of its residents. That's a pretty fair trade-off for the gas companies that are destroying our drinking water, don't you think? According to Business Week, the liquid that gushes from gas wells in Pennsylvania is only partially treated for substances that could be harmful when they're dumped into waterways used by communities for their drinking water. My God, that was a long sentence, wasn't it, folks? The funny thing is, Pennsylvania American Water, who supplies our clean drinking water, is strangely silent about the goings-on with the fracking in Northeast Pennsy. The only thing they've done so far is to release a pithy little statement on their website claiming they're working very closely with the state's DEP. The state's DEP is totally overwhelmed, so drinking our water is now out of the question. This week's piggy is Governor Tom Corbett and his gas company cronies, because I know in my heart we will never get free health care. We will never get cheap heat. We will never get free college education. We will just get shitty drinking water. Hmm. I'm A.P. Ticker. And I speak for the trees.